I'm not wearing black. You can wear whatever you want. I'm going for Tracy. Don't want anybody to think I'm mourning that man. Well, if you want to help Tracy today, we have to, uh, well, at least seem confident. What do you mean, seem? Well, I'm just saying the only reason we're going today is to support her, and what good will it do her if we're both looking as anxious as she is? I know, I know, you're right. I'm sorry. <sighs> Not a word, Ken. I don't know where you're going, if he's the pig you said he was. Didn't your solicitor tell you it is very important to show remorse? Oh, like, go easy on the slap, then. You want to go for washed out, not tied up. You've had enough in an hour or so, love. OK. Thank you. You've still got time to see the doctor if you want. we will give you something for your nerves. No. No, it's OK. I think it's better that I keep a clear head, but uh, thank you. You know, it's hard to pull off the whole unstable, battered wife bit. Courts have seen it all before. Not from me, they haven't. Maria. You're right, David. Cab's here. Something to give us a few more minutes. I think that's it. Do you know them? Yeah, I've been out drinking with him a couple of times. The crematorium bloke asked me if I wanted to say a few words. And do you? Well, no, not really. I'm just going to ask them if they want to say it. You're never going to guess what. It's kind of dangerous. What are they doing here? They don't want to say out either. Are you all right? Yeah. Tracy. <sighs> She's the one that done Charlie. Answer, isn't it? No, I believe Come on. Like, yeah. That's a moon. It's my place, isn't it? I'm turning up. David. Hey, she could sing. She could do. Hit me, baby, one more time. Shut up. Will you have a bit of respect? For that pig. This is awful. I'm going to say something. Ray. You do realise the lunchtime rush has already commenced? Oh, look, you haven't come in like that on a day like today, have you? <sighs> Someone at Hostel robbed my best coat, didn't they? Well, I said best. It was my only coat. Um, shall I get my wash in these parts? Look, now that you've got a job, have you given any thought to moving out of that hostel? Where to? Well, I don't know. I've got a flat. <laughs> oh, aye. First month's rent, another month's deposit. Yeah, I'll take two, so I have a choice of an evening. Have you got any fresh pillow pads? Scratches come off this. Just... Be strong, love. You'll be home with us before you know it. We're doing everything we can. I, uh, just want to say something. Charlie was my boss. He was my best mate and all. He was a good laugh. We spent a lot of time messing about and that. He taught me a lot. Not too much, I hope. Not just building work, loads of stuff. I suppose he was one of my best mates. Anyway, I just wanted to say that. I'll miss you, Charlie boy.
happy now? Happy? This is all your fault, you evil little cow! Tracy! Maria! <laughs> what are you crying for? Have you forgotten what he were like? Oh, I know that he did some terrible things, David, but... He didn't deserve all this. <laughs> Come on, let's go on. It's all over now, eh? <laughs> I promise you, love, we'll have you out of there any day now. The solicitor's really hopeful. I'm sorry. We've got to get her back now. I'll be fine, Mum. I'm a grim bitch. What did you call me? You weird. Look after Amy for me. Not much of a send-off, eh? Well, you did everything you could. Come on, let's go. It's all over now. <laughs> Rise or something. I'm starving. You and me and all, actually. Yeah, all right, just let me get changed, eh? Aya, how hey. was it? Not much fun. Are you coming up? Yeah, just leave it open for me. Well, I'm not going to be much company. Don't matter, does it? I mean, we're mates, aren't we? Yeah. Thanks, David. Just buy us a fry up and we'll call it even. <laughs> Deal. Oh, I feel better for that. Not eating since yesterday. Don't look after yourself. <laughs> Who are you, my dad? No, I'm just saying, you know. No, I'm only winding you up. <sighs> it's been a real shock, you know. You don't expect someone you're seeing to get... <sighs> you know. Can you stop going on about Charlie? Yeah, sorry. Oh, I was sorry to leave you on your own, Becky. Oh, that's all right. It's one of them, too. It was my fault. I, I just wanted a word with Ray. Uh, Hayley had the idea that, that we needed to clear out uh, upstairs. You should see the junk up there. Claws, books, all sorts. Anyway, um, we've decided that we're going to have a, a car boot sale. Oh, and we thought perhaps the, the uh, proceeds could go towards a deposit on a flat for you. You two want to sell your stuff and give me the money? Well... It's doing us no good up there, is it? And uh, and if you could help us sell it. I mean, in, in all honesty, you're, you're probably doing us a favour anyway. De de decluttering one's possessions, it is a well-known tonic. <laughs> I've to go to a couple of old winter courts and all, um, you know, I'm going to give them to a charity shop. They're all the old, but they might do you for it. Time. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> no one's ever been as kind to me as you two. <laughs> yeah. Do you know, it's funny. All this has made me think about my own life. What do you mean? Well, it's a big wide world out there, isn't it? You're not thinking of moving away, are you? Nah. Oh, I don't know. There's not much keeping me around here, though, is there? 18 perms a week and drinks in the Rovers. Yeah, well... Well, your mates are here, aren't they? And... And I'm here? Yeah. I know. I was just thinking, that's all. You know, I don't think I could stand it around here if you went. <laughs> don't be daft. I mean it. What are you doing? Nothing. I'm... Are you off your head? You're a kid. Well, I'm a lot closer at your age than what Charlie was. Get away from me. All right. So you won't come near me, but you don't mind hopping into bed with that psychopath? Oh. He tried to kill me, Maria, and you're booing over his flaming coffin. This conversation's over. 
so I'm OK as a shoulder to cry on. What about how I feel? Will you listen to yourself? This isn't about you, David. <laughs> Is that what today's been about? You think you're going to be my... What? Boyfriend? Get away from me, you freak. <laughs>